Hey guys and welcome back to my channel This Curvy Yogi. I am Jakita and welcome back to my series 30 Days of Yoga with This Curvy Yogi. And today we are going to work on the transition from wild thing to will pose. So this is going to require a lot of upper body strength and it's going to be a big back bend. So I recommend doing a few of the other videos first on my 30 Days of Yoga journey and then coming back to this one. So grab your mat and we'll get started. So we'll start in a table position. So we just want to make sure that our wrists are underneath our shoulders and the knees are directly underneath the hips. From here, we'll start with a couple of rounds of cat and cow. So on the inhale, drop the belly down towards the floor, pull the chest forward, coming into cow pose. Exhale, curling the upper back, chin comes to your chest, cat pose. Inhale. And exhale. Last time, inhale. And exhale. Coming back to table from here, we're going to come into downward facing dog. So tuck the toes under, lift the hips up and back. And then we're going to come into three leg dog. So lift that right leg and then open the hip, bend the knee. Straighten the leg and bring it back down and then lift the left foot, bend the knee, open the hip, straighten the leg and come back down, come back down to the knees, back into table, inhale as you drop the belly, coming back into cow pose, exhale, curl the back, cat pose, Inhale, and exhale, last time inhale, and exhale, and from here we're going to come back into down dog, but this time we're going to practice wild thing pose. So I would recommend that you come off of your mat just a little bit so that your foot can land on the mat. So I'm just going to bring my left foot or my left leg off of the mat and the right foot is still going to be on the edge. So from here we'll come back into downward facing dog. Then we'll inhale, lift that left leg up, bend at the knee and then bring it down behind you and then curl the upper back. Then we'll come back up and down. Then we'll lower, come back to sit on the heels and we'll move to the other side. So again, coming off of the mat, just a little bit, so this time the right leg will be off the mat, the right knee and the right foot, and the left will be on the edge of the right side of the mat. We'll come back into downward facing dog. Lift that right foot up, open the hip, bring the foot down behind you, and then lift the body up. Then we'll come back and then bring the foot down, lower to the knees, this time we're going to come back into table pose.
from here, the right foot out, lift it in line with the hip, bend at the knee, and then with the opposite arm, reach back and grab it, and then lift up. And then release, coming back down. Do the same on the other side. So extending the left foot, lifting it up, bend at the knee, reach back with the opposite hand, grab the foot, and then reach up. And then release. We'll sit back on the heels. Take a couple of deep breaths here. Inhale. And then exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. So we're going to trans transition from wild thing to wheel. This transition may happen today. It may not. If it doesn't, that is okay. Just do what you can. So we're going to come off the mat like we did for wild thing. You will have the right leg on the mat or the right foot on the mat and the left off. So this time when we transition from wild thing to wheel, you will bring that, the hand that's hanging out in the air, you'll bring it down and then lift the body up. So we'll come with um, back into table. You'll have the right foot on the mat, the left foot off. And then we're gonna transition into wheel, into wild thing first and then wheel. So once you get into wild thing, you'll actually bring that left arm all the way down. So tuck the toes under, lift the hips, lift the left foot, bend that knee, And hold for a second and then we'll come down stay here circle through the wrist in both directions and breathe And then we'll come up to sit. So from here, we'll attempt it on the other side. And because I got it on the other side, this side may be a little bit different. That's okay as well. So we'll come back onto hands and knees. We'll come off the mat with the left foot still on the mat. Then come into downward facing dog, lift the right leg, bend, come back, and if you made it back into wheel, great job. That was not working for this side today, so. I'm gonna end it right here. So we'll come to sit. 
and let's just end with three deep breaths so take an inhale exhale inhale exhale last time inhale and exhale your hands to your heart namaste hey guys thanks for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it if you did go ahead and give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below hit the bell for notifications and i hope that you will go and check out the rest of my videos in this series and i hope to see you in my next video